run back to base, a fight in the top lane. Oh, Impact's gonna slice out, does have that dice available, not gonna be needed as now Bengi's coming in from the river. The question is, can he get onto no. Stake? Stake's oh! always gonna rock in a hard place. He may be able to pick up first by the Impact, gets away, that's a flash! Flash for flash, Bengi lands it. But remember that Henao is alone in this lane. Yeah, comes Bengi from behind, the bubble doesn't land, the Vault Breaker does, the Sultan battery should be channeled in the not too distant future. In the background, Piglet and Bandy were locked up by the chain of corruption, but Stake is the burnout. To back away. A little afraid of no. Stake now, Stake why? Bengi's going to get Bengi comes in, the red buff is busy sticking. Impact throws down the ignite, plus the damage over time. That's a flash for Bengi. Throw every single lane to level for them. And Bengi, of course, standing on pink for the Dragon Oracle. Maybe we'll not see this coming either. The assault and battery is going to follow in. Here comes Faker. Paper tries to get away. He is going to get taken down. Puck's dead for his blood. He puck passes down as well. Bengi's not done. That's deadly, brother. And he's going to go down for this one. Did manage to pick up Mandu in the process of that one. Put down Piglet here as we are going to see Strangle Thorns going in. There's the crescendo. But here comes Bengi from the side. They've not seen it. This could cost them. Deadly Brother surely going to be finished off. Bengi picks up another one. This will be a two for one in the end. Right. Two Mandu did go down. But Ezreal, me and Ezreal will be it starts with his passive down, it's very vulnerable, and his dash is gone. Yeah, three men on top of him right now. Chances of survival, zero. Big against that one, that's his fourth of the game. He does have his passive up for the help. And yes, he does need it. It's going to go aggressive on him. Yes, lightning surge will come out. That's going to put a lot of damage down on Bengi. Like you mentioned, he has got it, but blood price is on. Barrow, Barrow comes in. Games that the European teams played this year against each other. Uh -oh. means they're strong. This is going to keep happening. Yes, he's just dead. I mean, he's three lane here. Impact six. Gets, did now six. The ultimate's up. A giant mini wave and Bengi on the backside. There's not a great deal Godlike can do about this one. He's just going to drop and die on this one. It's first look of Bengi. This is where it gets in. Bigger is absolutely level six. And Bengi's going to try and combo in the game. He goes in. Does he manage to knock him off? Yes, he does. Surely the shot plane comes in. But it does not matter. First blood breaker. <laughs> they need to get Faker going on the clock. One more oh. time on the white. He does not have that flat drop. It looks like he does get a good shot wave down, but it looks like coming from the backside. Could be at least a little flash available along with exhaust as well. He's feeding the pressure. The crowd are cheering him. He's trying to get away. He gets caught with the counter strike after the flash. Exhaust was goes down, but that will be first blood for Becky. What he actually risks his own help. There's no exhaust. Now you can see him at the good kick he does. He is going to go down. He's likely to not make the damage to the impact. I'm pretty sure he's now splitting the same with the different ball and over. Here they go. There they go. Fake is going to be the focus. He is going to go down. The pop will come out. Reginald will pick that one up. Dyrus drops in the meantime. Piglet comes in around the side. He takes down Reginald. Reginald will come out. He's going to count on towards impact. Who gets cocooned or locked up by the Tibbers. But he's still going to... Now Bengi is sticking to him. Sonic Wave can it catch. That is the question. It does. He follows up. Sword Art in trouble. 100 HP. The Volatile Spidelin goes down. The Cocoon does not connect. This Bengi could be three. gets a safe art shield. We do see the Sonic Wave gets dodged by the Repair. Wins lands down, does get taken out. Basically hanging around on the sidelines. We do see NL has been caught. He's been kicked back with that NL. Dead to right. Now Stake will be the next one. Bengi's been setting up a good push kick of his own. There's the ultimate coming down. Mandu burst down to almost nothing, but Bengi right on top. There's oh! a kickback. Pretty dying, but he takes one with him. And he's done well to get out of that in the way that he has. It's not over. might not have the same. He's going to fall. Bengi picks up another one. Flash though, nor an exhaust for that piglet and the top lane right now. Brain Kane have been jumped. Oh! Impact on in. Ignite ticking first by Pin Secured. Now Impact been hit by the tower shot. True damage land. Oh! Flash from Prey Impact gets out. That's a second kill for SKT. Bengi and Impact over the moon. And the bottom lane gets to mid lane. But look at this. Bengi's on the side. He's blind, but he can sneak blood. Oh, Here is no! he lands it on top of Nogne. He was stunned stationary there around the corner. First missile, it actually catches onto the minions though. Now two men in trouble. We do see Watch gets caught up. The condemned does land. Watch gets shredded down as Play was unable to secure the kill on that bottom lane. The rest of SKT now, a three man pressure on the tower. And man, the Piglet's just chunking in there as Bengi. What a move around the back here. So oh, they're actually going to pull. pull him in. Back there here, in all kinds of trouble. He lands the charm. Can they get across? Flash from Bengi. Lands the Q. There's the kill from Baker.
steady with that principle. So he's going to be hammering on the top lane. Sorry, oh. Bengi tries to hold on to this lane. He's going to get hooked. Where's the fear going to send him? Pretty much perfect there. He's down to less than half HP. Can he escape off from this one? Yes, just about underneath the turret. Already seen the world. As we said, world are extremely weak. And even though White's, oh, he's a little too over this. Behind the turret, they go in. It's a one. Impact's just there to take a Polaroid. Oracle on Bengi, may well force. Godlike is gonna get caught out, the kick comes in, Impact's gonna follow on through, Godlike gets kicked back in towards him, he's gonna get created, he's gonna get dropped out. Equalizer was down in time though. Uzi gets caught out, he's in trouble. Looks like Uzi may make it out, he bursts the flash, gets another oh, rush, they, can he, oh, he puts on the barrier. No, Impact gets the leap strike. They take him down, though, away from him from the back, and Lucky tries to hit him with the first time, no, he's done. Why is he so no? There's a shockwave though, he lands it onto two of them and look how low both Prey and Expression got. Here comes Bengi, are they going to yes. fight? Oh, he wants it! He does go in there but he's going to pay the price. The shutdown coming in for Nagne.